Welcome to another Control Hobbies video tutorial. This video will show you how to use the Grapner Firmware Upgrade Studio, where you can update your Grapner receivers, speed controllers, gyro receivers, telemetry modules, and much more. Before you start the Firmware Upgrade Studio, you will have to connect the USB update board that came with your radio to your computer. The following receiver update procedure is applicable for the following Grapner receivers. GR4, GR8, GR12, GR16, GR24, and GR32. This also includes all the L variants, such as the GR12L and GR24L receivers. Prepare the receiver by inserting the two-wire update connector, marked orange and brown from the USB board to the receiver update port. On the GR4 and GR8 receiver the update port is on channel 3. For the GR12 receiver, as well as any other 6-channel receiver you will be using channel 5. The GR16, GR24, and GR32 the update cable goes into the telemetry port marked with the letter T. You will also need a power source such as a receiver battery during the update. After launching the firmware upgrade studio, Make sure that in the port selection menu there is an active COM port selected. Click on the hot device option which brings up the firmware update dialog. Click on the auto download button which will start the receiver model detection phase. Press the set button on the receiver and power the receiver on. A dialog will pop up which shows the applicable firmware version for the detected receiver which in our case is a GR12L receiver. Select the firmware and click on File Download which will automatically start the firmware update process. If needed, the Firmware Upgrade Studio will ask you to perform a receiver reset. Follow the directions on the dialog. This concludes the firmware update process for the Grapner standard receivers. Next, we will show you how to update Grapner gyro receivers. The following receiver update procedures are applicable for the following Grapner gyro receivers. GR12, GR18, GR24, and Falcon receivers. For the GR12 receiver, as well as any other 6-channel receiver you will be using channel 5. The GR18 and GR24 the update cable goes into the telemetry port marked with the letter T. You will also need a power source such as a receiver battery during the update. Now let's get started with updating our receiver. To update your gyro receiver, you will need to manually download the firmware from the product support page. Click on the link option to reveal additional menu options. Look for the slow flyer and gyro receiver downloader option and click on it. This will bring up the software loader dialog. Verify that the COM port is selected and click on the data menu option and select the firmware for your receiver model. Verify that the proper firmware is loaded and click on the start button first and then power your receiver. The firmware will now be loaded into the receiver. Wait till the progress bar has finished which indicates that the firmware was loaded successfully. This concludes the Grapner Hot Gyro Receiver Update Tutorial. If you need to update a Grapner Speed Controller or Telemetry Module, check for those videos on our website at the product page. Thank you for watching and if you need additional support, you can contact us at controlhobbies.com.